All too often, kids go to school hungry, and that has a big impact on how they learn. But a volunteer-run breakfast program at George J. Elementary ensures students get to class with full bellies. And as Tess Van Stratton shows us in this week's Vital People, the woman who runs it is making a big difference, one smoothie and egg sandwich at a time. Good morning. Kathy Carter greets each student by name. Hi, Marvin. As she serves up breakfast every school day. You want pineapple and oranges? At George J. Elementary. The kids get to come in, sit down, have a full breakfast before school, and start their day off in a good way. Kathy, a longtime education assistant at the school, has been running the volunteer breakfast program for the last 10 years to make sure kids aren't hungry. When a child is fed, that's one less thing on their plate. No pun intended. They're able, they're ready to start learning as soon as they get into class. I think it's really amazing that they can like give food to kids and it's really delicious. Some people don't even have enough money to buy food, so I feel like it's really amazing she's doing this. Here you go, hon. Enjoy your breakfast. The kids love the program and Kathy. I love Kathy. She's super nice. And a smoothie. There you go, buddy. I think it's a very good job, and thank you a lot to Kathy. And yes? Yeah? She's amazing. She's really kind, really sweet. I think it's so amazing that she does all of this for us. She's a saint. She's, she is at the grocery store on Sundays shopping. Um, just the, the love and devotion she has for this program is, it's admirable, and I just, I'm so grateful to be a part of it. It wouldn't be possible without donations and lots of dedicated volunteers. It's a community effort. It's not just me. I couldn't do it without uh, the financial aid that comes in from the community and my volunteers that I have every single day. I just picked up a donation of coats. Kathy also runs Coats for Kids. Gently used or new coats are best. To help families in need. I'll go home and go through, make sure the zippers work and that there's no holes, and then make sure they go to a kid that needs them. Donations are currently being collected at Hillside Centre and demand is higher than ever. This year has been a huge demand, probably our most so far. And it's not just um, the schools and the um, programs that have been calling us. We've been getting people finding us on Facebook. But giving back is in Kathy's DNA, and she's just grateful she can help make a difference. I was a single mom of three kids, and I had amazing support from uh, friends, from my family, and I was just brought up that you give back, you pay it forward. I'm grateful for the life that I was given, and I'm grateful for the life my children have been given, and so I just pay it forward. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.